Um, sometimes in pre-season you pick up different niggles or injuries or games don't go the way you want them. But and I said that to the players the other day without trying to, to go over the top, that you know they've been, to be fair, attitude application in all aspects of it. And we've probably gone, I wouldn't say slightly lighter in the amount of games. We've had no midweek games this year. We've just gone Saturday games, double headers on a Saturday to try and get everybody 90 minutes. And I think what we've been able to do is get a lot more work into into players um, and a lot more games into players, but more importantly, a lot of training sessions into players as well. You know, in pre-season, all of a sudden, if you play Saturday, Tuesday, Saturday, you end up a three-game week. The Thursday's a wipeout, and possibly the following Tuesday is a wipeout from a safety point of view, ensuring that players recover and, and get their legs going again. We found that just by playing on a Saturday, it allows us both or through the week and our sessions through the week um, to up the ante and get a lot of good sessions in there as well. So you know we feel we're in a good place, a real good hub, a real good buzz about it, a real good hype at this point in time. Um, and it's like it's, it's every year you get that. I think Saturday was the first sign of it where we were good, we were solid on Saturday, but it just had that feel of right. Let's you know finish with these friendlies and, and and start the real thing. Well, the real thing is Friday night here. Sue Brown's opening, opening the whole league uh, against our rivals and, and, and local neighbours, Balamina. How exciting is that? Um, it's just exciting to be back, and I think when you throw a derby into it as well and you put it on a Friday night under lights, it's, um, it ticks all the boxes that you're looking for. So, you know, if you can't be up for that one and you can't be looking forward for that one, you know, you, you really shouldn't be in it.